do I believe bones can grow longer after puberty, in adulthood, after the age of 25, after the age of 30? I'll answer that question in this video and uh, start to talk about why, why I believe bones can grow uh, longer. Uh, but first, uh, I'd like to answer a couple of comments I got recently. Uh, one person asked if I could measure myself uh, on the statiometer like I did in one of my first vi videos. Uh, good request. Um, this, okay, I'm, I'm going to see, see what I can do, and th this is why. This is why I say that. Because in my home, when I got that uh, statiometer, the new statiometer that I, that I got uh, back in April, <clears throat> I tried putting the statiometer in different places, but unfortunately, uh, I discovered something about my floors. The floors are uneven. You know, I have carpet in, in certain parts uh, of my home, but in other parts, uh, there's no carpet. But when I try to place the statiometer there, I discovered that, that the floor is actually uneven, and, and you got to set the statiometer up a certain kind of way, and um, so, and, and because the floor was uneven, if I actually step on the statiometer, uh, it's like I could actually like break the, um, whatever you call it, the, the base of it. And so I found a, a perfect space for the statiometer, but unfortunately that space is very narrow, so you can't get a complete body shot um, like uh, may be desired. Uh, however, however, uh, what I can do is uh, next time I swing by the gym, I can get on the statiometer again, and what you will see is my evening height. My evening height. Okay? Um, because, or evening, it'll be e either my evening height or my afternoon height whenever I go to the gym. I, I typically don't like to go to the gym in the morning. I do other stuff for the morning. So, yeah. So that's that. Now, about bones. Well, I really feel like uh, answering that in another video, but I'll go ahead and, and answer that. And we'll start to answer it in this one. Yes, I really do believe bones can grow longer in adulthood after puberty. Now, before I state my reasons, let me just say this. The reasons that I'm going to give you are very simple. It's very common sense. I'm not going to complicate this. I think that's where a lot of people make mistakes. In life, I've learned a few things. And, uh, and what, I, what I've learned is, Sometimes when people try to be too smart, when, it, when they try to complicate things, they stagnate and they don't move forward. And they can actually give themselves convincing reasons for not doing something that may actually be worthwhile. And, and they can give such convincing, it, may, it really sounds convincing and they use big words and all this. Look, I'm going to... Um, really make this simple and it's my belief that in life some of the most wonderful things are actually very simple take the the beauty of life and, and, and this is important as I share my reasons I'm gonna be I'm, I'm gonna say simple stuff now there may be people who come and, and you know and say who are you to con conjecture on on this you know maybe you know educated people might try to you know put down what I say okay but I'm gonna share some really simple principles and I'm just telling you ahead of time that there will be people who challenge I hope it's not people who challenge what I say because it's going to be so common sense. It's just dumb. I, I, I'm going to try to make it so common sense. It's just dumb to challenge what I say. Okay? And, and again, it's not something that I own. What I'm, what I'm going to speak 
is wisdom that was around before me. And I'm just the messenger. You may have realized this. Other people may have realized this. I'm just telling you my thoughts. But beforehand, just letting you know, it's very simple. And someone may come, you know, at a university or whatever with their big words and their, and their big degrees and try to discount what I say. But here, here's the thing. The earth was here before any university was built. The earth was here. People, here's the thing. People build universities. Universities don't build people. Okay? In a philosophical, ideological kind of way, yeah, you could say they do build people. But then the question is, what kind of people do, do they build? But, okay, but, you know, outside of that philosophical, ideological type of thinking, I'm just saying, you know, in a uh, common sense type of way, universities don't build people. People build universities. Another thing, people can quote books all day, day long, but here's the thing. People write books. Books don't write people. Okay? So just because there's something, some knowledge in a book, there could be wisdom over and beyond what's in that book. Oh, man, life, life is, is very complex. Life is very beautiful. It's very wonderful. And, and, and sometimes, I, I, sometimes many of us, we get things out of place. We get things out of place. So, I just want to let you know that. It's going to be very simple. You, you take me and you. We are very complex human beings. If you knew the science in just the tip of my pinky, it is incredible. A lot of people think it's no big deal. The, the science just right here, right here. It's, it's, it's out of this world. It's, it's insane. If you really knew what was going on, 